Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvanian toy reviewer and collector himself. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we'll be reviewing an item from Batman Missions. And this is the Batman Missions Batcave. Three-in-one Batcave. And this is a product shot of everything on the box. Plus, we get a Batman figure included. So there we have some nice artwork of Batman. The Batmobile for this set. Which didn't come included. I got that sold separately. If you saw that review on that, then you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and here we got the uh, chamber where Batman can ready himself for action. The armory. The, the uh, prison. And the Bat computer. And then it flips over to Gotham City. I didn't put the stickers on mine because I couldn't get them off the sheet. I always have the worst problem with stickers. And yeah, this is three in one. Well, that's all there is to say. Package in, but before we show it off, we're going to show off the back of the box. Or the front of the package in. Here we got some more product shots and everything it does. Pretty cool if I do say so myself. The bat signal, which is definitely included. One part of Gotham. The underground part of the bat cave. And a lot of other stuff, and that's all there is to say. For the package in, let's get on to this set. But first, we're going to review the Batman missions. Batman. I am the knight. I am Batman. <laughs> and I couldn't help that. But he's a pretty good, decent figure. Articulation is really good. Look at that. Good articulation. I love that. He can get some kicks and be like, kick ya, kick ya. <laughs> he gets bends at the knee, but I'm afraid I might snap a joint, so I'm just going to not bend his knees. But there we have him in his glory. And now for comparison with some other Batman figures. Here he is next to my first Batman Missions Batman. This is going for the more animated look. That's one. And I got another one also in the animated look. This is more like the Adam, Adam West color Batman. And those are the figures bigger than the 4 inch figure. And finally for comparison, we're going to bring in, you guessed it, my McFarlane Harley Quinn. And I like this Harley Quinn a lot. So that's all there is to say for that figure. <laughs> so now we're going to show off the most important thing. Can he fit in the Batmobile? Because I've been needing a figure to fit in my Batmobile for a long, long time. Gonna open up the Batman door. The cockpit door. And he can fit in the Batmobile. I am so happy to have a Batman that can fit in the Batmobile. And he can gas up his Batmobile, like this. Some gas in his gas tank. That was my gas noise, <laughs> pretty much. Now we're going to take the Batmobile out of the review, because we're done with that item. Next on the list, we get two ladder pieces. And these are for... For getting up to the Bat Cave itself. It looks pretty good. 
going up there, huh? Some nice cardboard board artwork pieces. That's really nice. And there's a jail which you can put four inch Batman figures in that are bad guys, which I don't have. Maybe I could squeeze Harley Quinn in there. Maybe. Maybe if I can get her in there. Harley Quinn is too big for the cell. Ah, what a shame. Harley Quinn is too big. That's what you expect for a McFarlane. Too big to fit in the jail. Indefinitely. For sure. And now we're going to show off the equipment. The armory part. And I have Batman figures just falling down like crazy. Sorry about that, people. But yeah. We got the armory with some golden Batman armor, which you can put on your Batman. Let's remove it from the armory. Starting with the chest piece. And the mask. If See if I can get it off. There we go. Maybe it's better if I put the mask on first. And then put the chest armor on. Like so. And then you can give him these fists to add to the uh, character play. Which is kind of tricky <laughs> to get them on and get them on is the trick part <laughs> if you know what I mean for sure <laughs> but really it's a good looking armor for Batman but you can take one of these off to give him the batarang and then he could be like oh take this Harley Quinn batarang batarang and I couldn't help that. And these latter pieces on my copy do not stay on very well. Now we're going to load the armor back into the vault, into the armory, and get him on the back computer side. Plug in one fist, which can be tricky, and I dropped a piece. There is a lot of piece dropping in this review. Sorry about that. And now we're going to remove the other fist. The other fat armored fist. Followed by the mask. The armor. And these just snap right back into place. Which is pretty cool with this set. Huh. But now we're going to lift up the tripod. And now we can be like... Back computer, tell me where the crime is. So says I, Batman. And there is going to be a lot of commentary to this review, because I like doing commentary talking with this review. And now we're going to flip it around to Gotham City. And man, does that look cool. <laughs> Harley Quinn, you and keep falling down on the job. And now he can go through this door and be like, Ugh, I'm coming for you, Harley Quinn. You're like, you won't get me, Batman. You're like, you think so? Ugh. You get what's coming to you, Harley Quinn. Nobody takes down the Batman. And you can throw these ladder pieces on this side, too, which is pretty cool. If you want to do it, it's an option of play, and options are good. And this trash can can dump debris on the bad guys. You're like, oh, you got me all dirty, Batman. <laughs> I have a lot of fun on these reviews. And now you can hit the bat signal to summon Batman into action. Criminals beware. I am Batman. And this is a pretty cool play set for anyone who's a big 
Batman fan as much as I am, would I recommend this set if you're a Batman fan? Yes, it is worth picking up and adding to your collection. If you don't have a Bat Cave, you can pick this up for 40 bucks on Amazon, and that's where you can find this set. And that's all there is to say for this review. If you like this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this. Oh yes, there is one final gimmick before we end this review. Batman can go totally ziplining, which I didn't show that off. <laughs> Sorry about that. Almost forgot something. Get the uh, handlebars in his hands. Then he'd be like, and get him towards the top. Because this is an added feature of play, and I'm going to show it off here. And now he can zip line and deliver some justice. Whoosh. There he goes to action. Now we are moving on. Rock on and rock out.